Hi guys, Trevor Carr here. In this training, I'm going to show you the simple little uh, method that I use. There might be other methods, I don't know, but this is the method I use in order to get my videos to autoplay like this. So, um, autoplay in a video is what I find to be the most effective in getting more engagement and higher conversions because the fact that the video starts to play when the people land on that page means you can grab their attention straight away. It, even if it's only visually and they're curious, they'll be curious enough to stay much more than if there wasn't anything that was kind of um, moving or playing. If it was just text like this, then you're likely to get a higher bounce rate. In other words, they're gonna bounce straight back and hit the back button. So the way I do this is I take one of my, um, my videos. Let's take this one, for example. This is uh, three products not to miss, which is this one here. I'll go to share, embed. I click these off. So all I want it to show is the player controls. I don't want to show suggested videos when it finishes because I don't want them going to look at somebody else who might even be talking about the same thing. I want to keep it to me. Um, and I don't show the video title and player actions, just the player controls. Then I've got this code here. So I would control C to select that. And in this particular post, where it says the uh, review video update. If I open that box up, this is the text here. Now I'm gonna copy and paste in the standard text that I just got from over here, okay? And then I'm gonna save and exit, update. And then I'm going to click on this link here to show you the page. And this is what it would be like if it didn't auto play. And now I'm going to show you how I make it auto play. So we've already embedded the video. It's already in there. What we're going to do is edit the code inside there with just one line of code. I just type in REL and I go, I, I get this kind of pre-filled on Google. But if you type in REL equals zero, for example, on Google, you're going to find this. This is the text, that you, the line of code that you need. REL equals zero and auto play equals one. So control A for all control C to copy that. And then over here, I'm gonna open up this this here. And where it's, uh, no, sorry, that's the, that's the wrong one, that's the previous one. Let's get rid of that. Um, I'm going to edit this page, this post, I should say. And in the video box, where it says REL equals, zero and amp that's the bit you want so you're just looking for the rel and you need to go up to and just before that semicolon and then control v to paste that in so that now it says rel equals zero and autoplay equals one then we click on save and exit and i'll update that page And then I'll click on the page just to make sure it's all working and it should be auto playing again. There you go, guys. And it's as simple as that. So that is how to get your videos to auto play. Hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you on the next video. All the best, Trevor.